What's up, shoot tubers? This is King Ali reporting in for Royalty Concepts TV. And today's sneaker review is going to be the LeBron 8 Low Sprite. What's up, people? I've been gone for a while. It's been a it's been a long time. I don't even remember the last time I did a sneaker review. Uh, I've been buying crazy amount of sneakers, but I just haven't done anything in a while. I've been done with a lot of stuff out here in Miami. Um, getting ready to move soon. Um, Texas is in mind. I'm not sure if I'm going to move to Houston or Dallas, but Houston is definitely <clears throat> definitely on uh, on the list. I had a lot of fun recently. I'm actually going again next week. Um, the sneaker scene out there is pretty decent. Uh, the sneaker stores are pretty decent. They got a lot of releases. One thing I noticed when I was there, compared to Miami, Miami for whatever reason, um, we're not getting a lot of releases here. I guess it's because we're so further down south on the map for whatever reason. I don't know, man. It's it's rare that you see stuff like this. Like I've heard these are like at Nike outlets or factory stores. I wouldn't call it the outlet no more. But these have been showing up at um, Nike factories recently. But the factory stores here, let me tell you something. Dude, it is dry. Super, super dry down here in Miami. Um, you lucky if you see something like this. Or if you could get your hands on them. I was able to get my hands on a pair at a local uh, shop out here. I wouldn't say a boutique store, but it's, uh, it's called Soulfly. Uh, went in there and they had a size 12 and I was like, yeah, let me go ahead and grab these. Because again, like I said, you do not see this type of stuff in Miami anymore for whatever crazy ass reason. Well, like I said, COVID uh, shipments and stuff like that. But anyway, let's get this review going. Just showing you guys what, I, what I've been picking up lately. This was today a few hours ago. Like I said, with the Soulfly, they had a size 12. Um... I love this color combination. I love royal blue and I love Volt. And as you can see, it comes with the Volt laces. Uh, I'm not going to go into detail review because there's a billion reviews out there now. Uh, there's, a bi there's a billion reviews out there now. So many people reviewing shoes. Uh, I'm not trying to actually be like a your average reviewer with me is just showing my taste in sneakers. I've been in the sneakers for a long time. I've been doing this since 96, not reviews, but I've just been in the sneaker game really, really heavy since 96. No, 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 I take it back. Yeah, 95, 96. My first shoe was the uh, Nike Zoom Turf 96, the Barry Sanders, the blue and white one. That was my first Nike that I actually paid money for. So that was my first Nike, and I actually paid money for it. I paid one twenty-five, I believe, and that was a lot of money back then. That shit was like two hundred bucks back then. But um, I was actually able to pick up a pair of those as well. I'm gonna probably do a video on those if I can remember to do it. Uh, I was able to find an Oregon colorway a few weeks back that was in really, really good condition. I actually wore those yesterday. But, uh, yeah, I'm trying to get back heavy with my reviews. As you can see, I got my Wildcats comic, image comic. I was a huge comic book nerd. I just got back into this recently. I got some Savage Dragon comic books as well, so not sure what I'm going to be doing. <clears throat> I don't know. I want to bring something different to my platform when I start doing my reviews. You guys know I already do make t-shirts. Uh, I do custom tees. Or whatnot, like match the sneakers or whatnot. But uh, there's something else. I just put it out because I'm. I just got back home. I've been cleaning. I've been cleaning my mattress and moving everything. I'm going like doing a deep cleaning right now. So forgive the background, but you know, whatever. I'm living life like everybody else. But uh, yeah, these are nice, man. If you got to, <clears throat> if you were able to get a pair, let me know down below. Uh, if you're looking for a pair, like I said, from what I heard, these are pretty easy to get right now. The Miami Knights colorway sold out. Like, if I had to choose between the Miami Knights over this one, it would have definitely been the Miami Knights one. Um, 
But for this colorway, like I think it sold out initially, but I think they did like a restock with several restocks or whatever. But these are sitting. I don't know why. I don't know why. But uh, these are super comfortable. I forgot how comfortable the eights were. You got the air unit right there, the visible air unit. I just love the way that air unit looks, man. Like that gel look, like that see-through gummy. I love these type of air units. Where Air Max, the original Air Max units. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, man. I'm trying to keep these videos short. That's five minutes and some change. Don't want to waste too much of your guys' time. Happy New Year, by the way. Um, and I also got to say, it's about to be wild this year. This is probably going to be one of the craziest years in sneaker history. There's so many shoes coming out. There's so many shoes coming out. And I'm like, dude, Nike and Jordan Brand is about to take all my money. Reebok too. Reebok, they got the questions coming out. They got the blue toe questions getting ready to come back out. Uh, they actually got some decent color uh, lows coming out in the questions. The answer ones are coming out. Uh, the original white and red ones, those are coming back. The penny, the penny ones, oh my God. I've been seeing other colorways of the penny ones uh, that just surfaced today. I got to get my Orlando penny ones, the uh, the black colorway, the black with the white wing, and I hopefully could get my hands on a pair of all white ones with the blue Nike check, the all-star version, I believe. Those hadn't came out since the original release in 96, man. This is not, I keep saying 96, 95, I'm sorry. Um, even though I got a pair of the Zoom Flight 95s, those are coming back really, really soon this year. Um, it's some Barkley CB34s. Man, it's like, it's about to be wild, bro. The Playoff 12s, Jordan 12s, those are dropping February 19th. The Big Bang 19, I'm sorry, the Big Bang LeBron 9s are dropping. Like, it's about to be wild, bro. And I'm like, man, like, I, I like to choose, like to choose what type of shoe I'm about to spend my bread on. This stuff is not cheap. This shit is expensive, man. Uh, especially when you're grown and you got shit to do. Um, I'm going to just try to keep it simple, man. Like, really? Depending on ones, I'm going to probably try to get two pair. I'm going to try to get the black and white Orlando pair and the white pair. If I can, I might double up on the, the, the OG color, though. The black and white one. That's like my favorite shoe of all time. Uh, the Big Bang Nines, I'm not even finna cross my fingers on that shit. Like, if I hit, I hit. If I don't, I'm not worried about it. Um, and like I said, this is just like first quarter from what I'm seeing. So I, I can only imagine what summer is going to look like in uh, fall, winter, holiday season is going to look this year. But all I can tell you guys is stack your bread up. Um, if you like me, if you're an 80s baby, grew up in the 90s, uh, influenced by the Late 90s, early 2000s, get ready to spend some money because there's a lot of heat coming out. A lot of heat coming out. But anyway, that's been the video for today. Um, I appreciate you guys watching. Those of you that have subscribed, I really, really appreciate you guys. Again, I'm back. I'm going to try to keep these videos coming as much as possible. Again, I bought a lot of sneakers over the past couple of months that I got to re do reviews on. And um, like I say, I'm in a, like I said, I'm in the process of moving right now and trying to get things situated again i might be going to texas and you know i want to get myself settled in and whatnot but more than likely man i'm gonna probably be still doing my reviews uh through the course of that time so again thank you guys for watching uh i appreciate it if you're watching this video man uh go ahead and leave a comment subscribe hit that thumbs up hit that notification bell and i'll get back to you guys soon oh and also follow me uh, on IG at the Crib Tees. Uh, that's T H E C R I B T E E S. Uh, I post a lot of content on there as well. Uh, like my daily grabs or weekly grabs or a shirt that I just made. And like if you go on there now, like you'll see, like I went to some boutique stores yesterday. I went to like three different stores that I didn't even know exist. Well, one store that I didn't know existed in Miami it was pretty nice. They had a lot of uh, Yeezys and you know what the shit everybody else is buying right now? All the the retro ones. They had LeBron eight South Beaches. They had everything. They had Kobe fives and there. So, uh, like I said, for more content, go to my IG 
at the crib tees. That's T H E C R I B T E E S. Appreciate you guys. I'm out.